Sheba? 645 right now. Andy Lippman's story is one that we here at 11 Alive have followed over the years. He's a cystic fibrosis warrior and runs the AJC Peachtree Road Race every single year. But his message amid coronavirus has sparked a viral reaction over social distancing. Liza Lucas explains. Normally, we catch up with Andy Lippman on the treadmill or running in his neighborhood. This time, it's a virtual check-in. Because for Andy, the call to stay home is deeply personal. His plea to the public, gone viral. This post is mostly directed at people who have said they want to live freely and hang out in groups at their leisure because they are not in their 60s and they don't have any chronic health issues. I promise you, those actions will cause the spread of this virus to people around you whose bodies are not strong enough to fight it. The author's words capturing the attention of thousands online, his urgency resonating with others who feel vulnerable. I think a lot of people, especially uh, in my situation with a chronic illness, cystic fibrosis or any chronic illness, they wanted someone to talk from their side. We're just saying that if somebody goes out, regardless if they're symptomless or not, and they come back home and they give it to one of us, we can die from it. On a daily basis, Andy dedicates hours to keeping his lungs healthy. I take 30 to 40 pills, do about, about two hours of therapy a day. I work out for about 45 minutes, 30 to 45 minutes, and I run three to five miles a day just so I can breathe like everyone else. His hope is that others will listen to the advice of experts and understand they can help change the narrative of COVID-19. Let's stand together by staying home so that one day coronavirus will stop being a virus and start being a memory. Sheba, Andy tells me that he is very, very thankful for those that have been staying home. He says it does indeed make a difference. Such an important message, uh, Liza. Does he still have plans to run the Peachtree Road Race if it happens? Oh, yes, this would be his 24th Peachtree Road Race. So he tells me he plans to be there running that 6.2 miles, even if he has to do so while wearing a mask. Oh, I love it.